today and all this week we are going to look at the number one if we look up here we can see the number one and to write one we get our magic finger and we start at the top and down we run that's the way we make a one okay so let's do it again start at the top and down we run that's the way we make a one here I've got number blocks and my number block is the number one and we can see he's one because he has only got one cube okay so that's number blocks number one on a tally chart let me see how many cars we've got in our car park oh we've only got one car in our car park today so on my tally chart, I'm going to write one line to represent one car. And that's one for one car. On our clock, and your mum says to you, what time is it? And you look up at your clock, you can say, mum, it's one o'clock. And she goes, how do you know? So well, you can say, when the big hand is on 12, and the little hand is on one, it means it's one o'clock. Well done. If I rolled the dice, we're playing a game, and I rolled the dice, and it landed on this one, this spot, this would mean that it is one go. So you get one turn, or you get one score. So this means one. Okay. Can you show me the number one on your fingers? Excellent. This is number one. Who can tell me one more than one? One more than one. Two. Excellent. It is two. So one more than one is two. Who knows that one less than one? Fantastic. One less than zero, one is zero. Well done. And if we were playing with a number line, we were learning and using a number line, and we said to you, can you find one on your number line? You would find it here. So this yeah. is where you would pay. This is number one. Okay. Yeah. And... I have got a couple of number sentences for you to practice. So we've got zero plus one equals one. And one plus zero equals one.